Lee and I were, were talking about it in the beginning, and I, I said to him, if I'm going to spend that amount of days with those guys, I said, they've got to be 18. I don't want, you know, reputations and bullshit in the way. It's got to be guys that'll work for Ridley the way Ridley wants them to work, you know. So I put forward a very short list of people, and everybody on my list is in the movie. There we go. I'm just gonna leave that there right next to Whoa! There was one guy that um, that was supposed to be in the movie, but he didn't end up being in the movie. And fuck are you gonna regret that? You dick. <laughs> Running down the hill and oh, oh. the strangle. <laughs> One of the reasons that they wanted to assemble the team that we've assembled to play the Merry Men is that the dynamic sort of already existed in our natural lives. I mean, I've, you know, I've known Russell for six or seven years, and I've, I've known him the least. I mean, he and Kevin and Scotty worked together in 1998, I think, you know, and they've remained friends ever since. The very first time that I, I worked with Russell, which was 11 years ago, which is crazy. He makes fun of me now because I have gray hair. <laughs> Go for the butt cheeks, kid. Go for the butt cheeks. Oh. <laughs> Scotty and Alan are constantly having little competitions with the rubber tipped arrows around the set between takes. And so they set up like a bottle and they were going at it for a while and they weren't hitting it, weren't hitting it. And then Russ said, can I have a try? I really haven't shot much with Russ. Russell goes, give me an arrow. And he gets up and I'm feeling like, oh God, here's Robin Hood. I hope Russell, my friend, hope he gets it. I, uh, at least within 20 tries. He looks at the bottle. Draws, boom. Oh! Hits the freaking bottle. So Russell is the best. Alan is second, and I'm a close third on Alan's tail. The interesting thing is, is the kind of acceptance or, or people just assuming you can do this stuff. Oh my God. Don't watch this. You hit the flag. You hit the ribbon. Oh, I'm not even close. Wow. <laughs> what are you judging me for? Now this comes out and you show 57,000 times it took to hit this bottle. Not even close. <laughs> I'll kill you. Oh, you hit everything but it. <laughs> Simon here makes all this stuff and knows how to use it far better than we do. Dude, I mean, I can't. I don't think I can get any closer. Simon and I worked on Band of Brothers together. Yeah, he was a lousy oh, shot on that one as well. <laughs> <laughs> but he's pretty tough on the arms, right? It looks like. Uh, yeah, but you again, it's like muscle memory. You, you just get used to it. It doesn't. Oh, he <laughs> <got> one <laughs> shot! Oh my God, prick! <laughs> you just made me look really good saying all that great stuff about you. <laughs> one <laughs> shot. That was going fabulous, man. <laughs> Oh, he knocked the stick out. Oh, that's ridiculous. This is the life of the Merry Men. This is just an excuse, this movie, because we've been just wanting to hang out and get together and have fun. <laughs> what sort of a freaking wedge is that? But I can ride a horse. <laughs> this has just been, I'm not kidding, the greatest time of my life. Go. We've. Uh, you know, we're barbecuing all the time. We're, we're staying yes. close to each other. On the weekends, our families get together, and it's really been, uh, it's, I'm gonna miss it. It's been a close family. <laughs> <laughs> ah, whales. <laughs> Russell has really brought us together in a way that, um, Cocktails. I haven't really experienced on other films. He, he has brought the four guys together and we feel like a team, like a unit, like a band. It's an honor and a pleasure to ride with them, eat with them, 
same with them. You know? We get to live here. You know? It's been uh, pretty goddamn amazing. ever been inspired to like really fucking kick some ass it's like working on a movie with Ridley Scott because it's balls out and every person in every single department is like the best at what they do and giving everything that they've got it's just an absolutely inspiring experience and, and it kind of scary because you're like oh wow what movie am I going to do after this, <laughs> you know, like after working with him? He's been incredibly generous and um, we've had a lot of fun, a ton of fun uh, making it. <laughs>